guys that was my back here with another video and in this video i'm going to be showing you guys how you guys can make this incredibly amazing outro in photoshop touch and android or ios whatever you want to use but before we get into the video i want to talk to you by something on 27 december i'm going to be using a graphic pack so stay tuned for that and subscribe if you haven't and uh, uh, there will be thing going on on my channel is if you comment on the video i will pick one of the comment and i will give shout out to the next video so i'm gonna do in every single video so if you comment and if i like that comment i'm gonna choose one and i'm gonna give a shout out to those so there was a two people who's my great friend one is Ansh Whitey and one is Zaluto both have a great content Ansh is going to do a four account giveaway one is Clash of Clans second is Agario third is FIFA 17 and fourth he's haven't decided so check out his channel he's gonna do all those giveaways and there is a guy named Zaluto he was doing, doing the late um, graphic content he's making his all graphics in Microsoft so if you want to have those like he was making great content in Microsoft that a lot of people are not able to do in Photoshop so check it out his channel he's not getting views I don't know why but he's just amazing so check it out his channel but before we get into the video there will be two to three images that i'm gonna use to make this outro all the link in the description so you can check those out and i'll leave this outro and one more outro in the description so you can go and download those outro and use in your video but before we get into the video please leave a like that would be amazing if you guys leave a 20 to 30 likes like that was amazing because that's what i want from the whole damn videos so that's all i'm gonna say let's jump into the tutorial if you want to so to make this outro what we have to do is click on blank document and then what you have to do is select one two eight zero and then seven two zero that will be width and height that you want to make the outro so when you're done with this hit ok boom this is gonna load up by blank document that's what you want you need blank document you don't need anything else so when you're done with this uh, please check it out if it is blank or not if it is blank then what you have to do is click on and button and then choose a dark color if you're gonna make it blue then choose dark blue if you're gonna choose red then choose dark red if you're gonna choose green then choose dark green so I'm gonna choose dark red I'm gonna make it red one because red is my one of the favorite colors so we're gonna choose red right up here so it's gonna look something amazing so when you choose with this this is gonna look something like that and i'm gonna use one image as i said as i told to you guys the image that i'm gonna use and link in the description so you can go check it out uh, so what you have to do is gonna i'm gonna take the image right up here the last one i'm gonna choose this one so let's hit that and add this and this is gonna fit perfectly and then when you're done with this you have to put an overlay and decrease the opacity um, as you want but if this doesn't like fit and look really nice you can change the color always i'm gonna choose to change the color i'm gonna make red from here right here as you guys can see it's looking very nice after changing the color but the bottom left is very saturated as you guys can see compared to the top right or to uh, bottom right so what you're gonna do is you're gonna make an empty layer and then go to gradient and i'm gonna choose this gradient and i'm gonna make it like this and i'm gonna set right here so this is even the whole damn thing better so we're gonna choose something like that this is looking amazing so we're gonna hit ok so as you after you get all the thing background is almost set what you have to do is you have to click up here and flatten all the layers and when you're done with this make an empty layer drag it down you have to drag this down the pan uh, bottom so select black color and then hit ok so it's gonna look something like that you're gonna decrease the opacity of your background because we don't want our background to highlight it more than our text we want our text to be highlighted so we're gonna make our background very dark so what you're gonna do is you have to make select and uh, show pointer and after that select this um marquee tool and make sure you have make an empty layer when you're done with this what you have to do is you have to make sure you have this at top so what you have to do is you have to make uh select whole damn background like this and when you're done with this what you have to do is click up here and then you have to transform this right from here 
what you're gonna do is you're gonna make it small this is where your video annotation and screen is going to be so i'm gonna choose right here i'm gonna set it right here this looks amazing so when you you have to click ok then go up here and make stroke and make it white or any color that you like and after that dislike that and then make it duplicate layer of this this thing we're gonna make it duplicate layer of this and after that we're gonna be transform that to right here but this is looking very big we're gonna make a bit smaller and we're gonna set it right here so when you're done with this hit ok and then delete the lower layer of the uh, thing and then make a duplicate of this and transform that right here and hit ok so we're gonna something like that and after that make an empty layer again and choose the circle tool this time this is where your logo is going to be i will uh, as you guys can see this is where you you have to set your logo annotation boom like that and then again you have to click on and and then fill and stroke put stroke but i will suggest you not make the circle one because sometimes like your logo appear a second after that so it's not look good so don't make this circle one you have to put your logo up here that's what i am demonstrate but don't make this stroke thingy like you will understand what i'm trying to say so when you're done with this what you have to do is merge all those layers boom 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 and after that what you have to do is you have to uh, make an empty layer oh no i wish i shouldn't have made an empty layer what you have to do is you have to go into text and make it text um, anything that you want i'm gonna make it thanks for and i'm gonna choose a merit merit pro this is the font that i really like so not have to put it on bold everyone always put bold on this but you not have to put it on bold and select white color not other color and set it right here and after this setting right here what you have to do is select other color uh, other letter thanks for watching we're gonna choose a watching as you can see you can write anything as you want but i'm gonna watch, uh, write watching and you have to make this one bold and you're gonna set right here and what i'm going to do is i'm going to change the color as well as to red color because my background is red um, you have to select the color that your background have and after that you have to first of all select the layer of watching and then select pixels and then go on to gradient and you're going to put a gradient that you want i'm going to put this gradient and i'm going to put right here not right here this is looking better than that so after that what you're going to do is we're going to make one more gradient and that gradient is going to be this one so i'm gonna put right here as you guys can see this is looking well so we're gonna put right here and that's looking amazing but after that your text is gonna look way better than before i'm gonna put a darker one again so what we want is we want our bottom of the text would be darker and top of the text would be a bit lighter than uh the bottom one obviously so when you're done with this it's okay and then we're gonna distract that as looking amazing as going to be so what we're gonna do is we're gonna make uh put some saturation if you want contrast saturation brightness you have to mess up with the color if if you don't like that so when you're done with this you gonna make other text also so i'm gonna make other text so i'm gonna make uh watch my i'm gonna write watch my uh playlist but we're not gonna write playlist yet we're gonna not making it uh bold we're gonna make it a uh, normal now we not make any text folder now we only write want something like that and you can choose any color that you want but you have to have combination of red and white or the color that you're using as you guys can see bold is not gonna look better but uh normal one is going to be looking better and when you get with this you have to write other letter that is going to be in white color that is play list as you guys can see so i'm gonna make this one white and i'm gonna put right here so when you're done with this we're gonna make it a bit smaller and hit tick mark and then i'm gonna select watch my layer and then i'm gonna make this as well uh low like smaller and then again we're gonna select a playlist one and transfer it above and after that select watch my layer as you guys can see i'm gonna choose watch 
my layer and we're gonna do the same thing that we've done with the the other text we're gonna select the pixels i'm gonna put the gradients two gradient that we always wanted to put so right here i'm gonna put the other gradient as you guys can see so after the putting those two gradients uh is gonna look your text is going to be looking amazing and you can merge if you want so after that you have to put some um drop shadow in that text is looking amazing we're gonna like transfer that a, a bit better so uh this is kind of boring so after i done all the text i'll be back like i have to write all the text by same method so it is boring very boring so i will be back when i will done with all the text so i done all my text as you guys can see is and over outro is 95 percent done we have to just merge all the layers down like this and our outro is looking fantastic but what you can do else is you can make an empty layer uh, and uh, make empty layer and choose a marquee tool again we're gonna select the whole uh lemon dragon no we're not able to success this time after that what you have to do is you have to put stroke not fill stroke with the color white and we're gonna put uh, like uh, six six is looking okay so dislike that and then you can decrease the opacity of this or leave it like that or you can put it on overlay that's what i like to do i'm gonna put this on overlay and this is gonna look amazing after that what you can do is you can drop the shadow on it something like that and this is all your outro is done looking amazing you can put playlist subscribe my channel and watch my random video that's amazing so i hope you guys like this video if you guys do so please leave a like comment for shout out in the next video and subscribe